What is up everybody, Bootman here, and we're back with another Marvel Snap video. And I just hit infinite, so I wanted to share with all of you the deck that I use, which I like to call Draculixi. All right, he uses a brand new card, Pixie, a lot of fun. So let's dive into it. But before we do, if you're new here, hi, my name's Chris, how's it go by Bootman? I love going over different deck card strategies to help you rank up the ladder when in conquest mode. So if you're into that, make sure you subscribe and ring that notification bell. All right, so let's jump into this deck. So this deck actually comes from uh, Revis. He's a great content creator, he streams. He comes up with some really cool decks. And I've, uh, I mentioned this in my last video about Mockingbird and why I'm so pumped about that card. I've been just having like so much fun with Snap lately. Uh, the new cards and just the way the meta's like been changing, it's just been so much fun for me. So I've been trying a bunch of different decks. I'm probably gonna record like two or three videos today. <laughs> just to schedule them out um, because I, I actually use quite a few decks to rank up the ladder. This is just the deck that I use for like the last like three or four ranks uh, on my way to infinite. But anyways, it utilizes Pixie and Dracula. Real quick, I have so many people on Twitter asking me, by the way, follow me on Twitter, link down in the description below, asking me if they should get uh, Pixie. First off, only get Pixie if you have Mobius, all right? She uh, swaps the cost with all the cards in your deck. Um, she can lower your cost, but she can also raise your cost, so make sure you got Mobius, okay? Mobius is also a good counter for everybody else who's playing Pixie. But yeah, as far as like, should you get her? Like, I honestly don't know. I do not know. I think all the cards this month are like decent. Like, we've had so many months where just like, the cards are just like, eh? Like, I even like, if a few cards, I just can't give you an honest answer. Like you're just gonna have to like watch videos decide if it's like your style of play and stuff like that. But yeah, I honestly, like this is one of the first months where I'm like, I don't know. I think like all the cards are pretty good. So anyways, you're basically, it's like a Dracula dump deck. This is basically a Dracula dump deck where you're using uh, Pixie. So you have a lot of uh, low one cost. We have zero here to uh, zero out our armor, but you can also use zero to zero your destroyer. And then we have Dracula and She-Hulk here. We got uh, Sunspot. So if we're soaking any um, energy for either She-Hulk or Infinite, but yeah, you can do some pretty cool stuff. I actually, like obviously there's like some really powerful combo stuff that you can do here if Pixie hits the right stuff and everything. I honestly barely got the combo and I won so many matches with this, all right? Um, yeah, your Cosmo and your armor also protects you from Destroyer. So this deck has back backup plans. I've really enjoyed like the Dracula uh, style like uh, uh, zoo decks, you know what I mean? So this one's just like a newer version with Pixie, all right? So anyways, anyways, if you're new here, I show the losses as well. This deck isn't 100%, no deck is, but I do want to show you what these types of decks lose to as well. All right, let's jump into a few games. All righty, toss a little uh, Sunspot over on that Ant Maze. Let's see. Oh boy, oh boy, this can go very bad. This can go bad. All right, we have a one and we have a three and four chance that we don't pull destroyer. And this game hates me. And the game hates me. <laughs> I've been playing against like, like aside from that, I've been playing against so many people like playing Iceman and stuff too. And I'm just like, like, you know, like if you ever watched Iceman and you're just like, please don't hit this one card, please don't hit this one card, and it just does, it does. It'll hit like my Mobius or something, you know? Oh my God. This will block their Zabu if they have one. Boom, called it. Doing a little Venom. Um, Let's do, let's do this in case they have uh, Shang. I have priority, that would have been cool. Been super cool. Let's do this just in case we get infinite, maybe. Uh they might be running um They might be running uh whatchamacallit. Um Odin, that's been very popular in these. So if they do that here, they'll be adding nine, 
19. 19, I'll be going up to... What if they Odin? That's going to go up to 12, 24. Yeah, I think we have to leave. Yeah, I blame... I blame this. I blame that right there. We could have been soaking, put pressure on two lanes. Sometimes that's that's just what happens. Like, is you know what I mean? Like, I'm like, oh, I'll show the losses. I'll show you what the deck can lose to. RNG. That's what else the deck can lose to, you know? A little fist bump all the way out. <laughs> I haven't seen that storm. <laughs> I haven't seen that storm one yet. <laughs> that was that was a nice little surprise. All right, everybody. Uh, we got our pixie for turn two. The icebox hit martyr, so we're 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 chilling. We're chilling. Ooh. Oh, this is nice. They're gonna be stacking that lane over there. Oh, I should have gone here. What am I doing? So, people have been running a lot of Valkyrie. Yeah, this seems like the Valkyrie deck. So, let's do one of these. Ooh, you're lucky. Oh. Like, if they're running a Valkyrie deck, that's not great. Um, let's do... Just wondering if I want to fill here. Yeah, probably. Probably. Oh. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. See? And here's where the dump comes in. Here's where the dump comes in, that big old dump truck. Now, if I pull, if I pull Destroyer, I'll be a little upset. Okay. If that's four, well, they can't do anything. I think we win this. Because even if that's a... Uh, or unless, unless they're playing, okay. Uh, I think I was playing a version maybe of this. This is another deck that I want to show you all um, that ran Blue Marvel and that could have, that could have got us in a little trouble. Ooh, Shuri's Lab. We got, we got some big, we got some big cards that we can, uh, and we got a little armor action. Remember what I was talking about? Remember what I was talking about with the uh, Iceman over here, remember? Give me zero. Not zero. Soak that up. All right, let's do that. Yeah, they're playing bounce. My cats, my cats are and bonkers. Maybe I can snag priority. Maybe. Because then I can put Cosmo here. They, they probably have Beast. Yeah. Yeah, they got, they got really good RNG and like, look at that. Look at that. Let's actually put Nebula over here. Yeah, we don't even have any other big cards in our hand. This is gonna be a Falcon, huh? We might have to leave. <clears throat> oh. Of 
sports. I'm like, oh, maybe I'll hit the rock. No. Yeah, none of our big cards are in hand. Yeah, we didn't pull any of them. Look at this. Look at these three cards. Thank you to the untapped deck packer. Affiliate link down below. But look at all my cards. Look at all of them just sitting in my deck. Reality. All right, last one. Yeah, but like, remember I was saying like, you know, sometimes like how many games I, I won without like pulling off the combo. Like with this deck, like you either need the pixie play or you need the, uh, uh the dracula play so like when you're not drawing like pixie or dracula like there's some problems to be had mm. this makes me wonder if they're playing like a, a surfer deck in which i do want mobius and i might not draw destroyer again so let's just do that What? Oh, we got the exact same cards. Let's try that. They just playing a Patriot deck. Sick. Let's pass and see what happens. Put this here. If they Ultron, they'll get, what is that? Plus two, plus three, so they'll have four power, four, eight. They'll have four, eight. So 15 here. 15 here. We can do that. We can do that. Then we go up. I don't know. I'll stay. I'll stay. Oh, did not expect that. Is this like a, a, a series one player? What is happening? Wow. That's interesting. I have not seen it. I'm like sitting there like, like, I don't know, maybe Ultron, like the abominations, like not even on my radar, like good for them. They're like, like a series two or open player who hit infinite, like, hey, hey. All right, everybody, that's Draculixie. It comes from Rebus. I'll link uh, his Twitter and Twitch down below. All right, great deck. It's a fun deck and it's pretty good. You just saw like some of the worst RNG ever, which happens in Marvel Snap. That's what happens. Like a lot of people have been frustrated on their climb to infinite. First off, it's the first week. If you don't hit infinite, who cares? It's a four week season, all right? But the other thing, like just take it slow, take it steady. I said this on Twitter, what I do, once I hit the tier, like when I go to from 70 to 80, once I hit 80, I like take a break for the day. Once I hit 90, I take a break for the day. You know, even during the 90s, like I would get to like 95, I would take a break for a few hours. And like, you just really play slow, you wait for your hands and stuff like that. I kind of wanted to show you guys how these games played out and everything. But like in the 90s, especially, I am retreating like a mug. But anyways, I like this deck, it's pretty good. A lot of people don't expect it. This deck hasn't gained too much popularity. So if you want, give it a try, just as you saw, if you don't get either Pixie or Dracula out there in a way to like dump your cards, like just play very, very smart and conservatively, all right? Anyways, that's all I got for the video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you're new, subscribe, ring that notification bell. Have an amazing rest of your day. I'll see you in the next one.